Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com with another three box break of Fanatics Under Wraps Autograph Baseballs. Love this stuff. Random player break number 18, number 19, and, and 20, I think, coming up a little bit later tonight. We'll probably get to 21 as well. As always, remember those autograph multi signed baseballs all go to one person, the person who gets the any and all multi signed baseball spot right there. Big thanks to this group for making it happen. Let's multiply you by nine. There's one, there's two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. All right, now let's set up all the the lists here, and let's roll it and randomize names and players three and a six nine times. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Three and a six, nine times for the players. One, two, three. Six, seven, and nine. It's Walker Bueller all the way down to Hip Hip Jorge. All right, nice, Steve. Any and all multi sign autograph baseball is going to you. Here's the first chunk of the list. There's the next part. I'm just going to roll through this. And then I'll alphabetize by your first name so you can see all of your players grouped together by your name. All right, now let's alphabetize by your first names. So Juan, there are your players right there with the Last Spot Mojo star next to him. Last Spot Mojo, 70% of the time, hits 100% of the time. Might be a little bit more difficult odds in this particular break just because there's so many spots, but good luck. Matt Smith has a bunch of players. There you go, Matt. Steve Birch, a ton of players as well. Good luck. And then Steve H. With the rest. All right, we're going to pause the video. When we come back, we're going to see if there's any trades. Then we'll have the break. Stick around. BRB. All right. TWC trade window close, and on WWE Raw, we got the Tag Team Championship happening here. Ooh, what? And Who Am I? America's favorite game. Good luck, everybody. What a night. What a night. All right. This one's gonna, this one should be pretty easy. Retired baseball player. Retired shortstop and third baseman, a righty. Hall of Famer. Two-time MVP, a rookie of the year, a 19-time All-Star, a home run derby champion, won a World Series, and two gold gloves, and two All-Star game MVPs, eight silver sluggers. Played his last game in 2001 at 41 years old. 62 now. Second round pick. Uh, I think he played shortstop mostly. But was considered tall for a shortstop. 6'4", 200, at, at least in those days. And was a first ballot Hall of Famer with 98.53% of the vote.
This is break 18, right? Yeah, we're break 18. Boom, Brandon's got it. Cal Ripken Jr., the Iron Man. And what do we got? We got an interesting baseball here. The stitching is different. Look at this. That's that's Oriole stitching. That's pretty cool. Oh, comm with commemorating the 1983 All-Star Game? Or 1993 All-Star Game. Sorry, can't read. That's awesome. An old school baseball with Cal Ripken Jr.'s autograph on it. The Iron Man, that's awesome. Steve Herrick with Cal Ripken Jr. Yeah, me too, Gabe. I like the I like the stitching. They should do that more often. Gives that stitching a little little pop there, a little pop of color. All right. Another retired baseball player. A former center fielder, switch hitter, 6'2", 180, five-time All-Star, four-time Gold Glover, won a batting title, four World Series, a Silver Slugger, and an ALCS MVP. Played his last game in 2006. Played his first game in 1991. Has a lifetime 297, 287 home runs. 1,257 runs batted in, 147 stolen bases, OPS of 858. Dilo, how'd you get that so quickly? Barry Bonds is a little more than 287 home runs, Alex. Just a little bit. I guess switch hitting center fielder who won four World Series in the 90s. And early two, does that, that, that gives it away, I guess? Here it is. Here's the 1996 World Series. Bernie Williams. World Series and center fielder. It's pretty good, man. D'Lo may need to go on baseball Jeopardy. All right, that's, I believe, is going to go to Matt Smith with Bernie Williams. Yes, Matt, there you go. And Dilo with the, with the good guess. All right, final box. And more coming up a little bit later tonight. who you are before you guess who am I. All right. Uh, active player, outfielder, bats left, throws right, an MVP, two-time All-Star, Gold Glover, three-time Silver Slugger, two-time batting title winner. Sported the number 21 and 22. Went to high school in Westlake Village, California. We've had this guy before. It is a, uh, your 2018 NL MVP, according to the inscription. He finished second in MVP voting the following year, too. But has fallen upon some tough times. 
Now, Dalbeck has not won a try. Alex tried to retract it. I saw it. Dalbeck has not won an MVP. Not Trey Turner. And this one goes to Matt Smith, by the way. Now, the other MVP that's fallen, the other NL MVP who's fallen on hard times as of late. Bellinger won in 2016? 2017? Was a, a Marlins first round pick. He's with the Brewers now. No, Mookie Betts has not fallen to hard times lately. He's played pretty well. Oh, we got to get this. Yelich, there, there we go. I was like, we just had him a break or two ago. Brandon's got it as well. Nice. Matt Smith with that one as well. There you go, Matt. A couple baseballs for you. There you go, gang. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. I'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.